So you're telling me Travis Scott might have cheated on his billionaire girlfriend Kylie Jenner? Make it make sense. What's up you guys, it's your girl Madison Hill here and we have so much tea to get into on this What's Trending Celeb Scoop and we have very little time to waste so let's go ahead and get things started talking about Kylie Jenner and Travis Scott. So you see recently a model by the name of Rojean Carr aka Young Sweet Row posted that she was on a music video set and fans were quick to notice that Travis Scott was seemingly in the background. In addition to that he also posted an Instagram story from a set that looked eerily similar. Now while posts like this normally wouldn't go viral and spark cheating rumors, when it comes to Rojean and Travis Scott, that isn't the case because these two were also linked back in 2019. Yes, TBT to when Travis Scott was first accused of cheating on Kylie Jenner a few years back with this same woman. Although they both denied relations with one another at the time, the scandal still led to Kylie and Travis breaking up for a bit. So you know, that kinda told people anything and everything that they needed to know. Anyway, back to present day, Travis Scott did his best to put these current cheating rumors to rest with a statement over on his Instagram story. He also added that he doesn't know nor has he ever been with this person, aka Rojean Carr. Now of course, Travis's Instagram statement just absolutely set her off and prompted her to post a long video message over on her Instagram story, accusing Travis of knowing her, hooking up with her, and she even said he tried to spend Valentine's Day with her. She also claims that Travis cheats on Kylie every night and that everyone knows it. Now, although Travis did his best to deny the Valentine's Day claim with a screenshot of his whereabouts on February 14th, that hasn't stopped the internet from believing the story that this woman is telling. Personally, the one thing I really can't get over here is how similar this woman looks to Kylie Jenner, so I guess if there is one potential truth to this situation, it's that Travis Scott definitely has a type. Moving on, let's talk about the drama that went down with Cardi B and Madonna. Yes, even icons fight on social media too. Anyway, their beef started when Madonna posted a message to her Instagram story talking about her book, Sex, that she released in 1992. She essentially said that Cardi B, Kim Kardashian, and Miley Cyrus have her to thank for being able to sexually express themselves. She ended her message saying, quote, you're welcome along with a clown emoji. Now Cardi B obviously saw this and was not here for Madonna essentially calling her a clown, so therefore in a now deleted tweet she wrote, I literally paid this woman homage so many times because I grew up listening to her. She can make her point without putting clown emojis and getting slick out the mouth. These icons really become disappointments once you make it in the industry, that's why I keep to myself. Now after a few more sassy tweets from Cardi, clearly her disappointment reached Madonna because then eventually these two ladies sat down and talked it out. And we know this because Cardi tweeted saying, I talked to Madonna, it was beautiful, have a great day, and drive safe y'all. Madonna also tweeted that she always has and always will love Cardi B. So thankfully I can say this is one celeb beef that was squashed before it got out of hand. Okay last but not least, let's talk about Kanye West. Yes, unfortunately this guy still has not learned to shut his mouth. Now as I'm sure you all know, Kanye West has continued going around and making anti-Semitic comments, and while he has has faced some consequences for his words like talent agencies stopping business with him and Balenciaga cutting ties with him, some of the other brands that work with him have remained silent. And the one brand that people are incredibly disappointed in is Adidas. Now during a recent interview with Drink Champs, Kanye West went viral for saying that he can say as many anti-Semitic things as he wants, but Adidas quote, won't drop him. Now while Adidas has put their partnership with Kanye quote, under review, people do not feel like that's enough. Yeah. The hashtag boycott Adidas continues to trend as people call on the brand to take a stance against Kanye, and I don't blame people. I mean, if Kanye's ex-wife Kim Kardashian and her sister Khloe can both post messages making it clear that they don't stand for hateful rhetoric, I think Adidas can too. Alright you guys, that's all I have for you on this What's Trending Slub Scoop. Make sure to follow and subscribe to us everywhere at What's Trending. Once again, I'm your girl Madison Hill, and I'll see you guys next time.